The year is 2010. Just one year removed from his fifth NBA championship, Kobe Bryant has continued his reign as the game's most iconic star. Seven. This is a must stop here. Kobe three. Good. He's unbelievable. I mean, Kobe looking for a triple over Dallas Bear. Yes! The best in the game has done it again with 4.8 to play. Averaging over 25 points per game at the age of 32, he was still firmly in his prime. But with the league beginning to change around him, the Black Mamba knew his legacy on the court had begun to cement itself. However, off the court, Kobe had begun to build a different legacy. After starting his career as a signature athlete with Adidas, Bryant had made the switch to become one of the faces of Nike basketball in 2003. His signature line of sneakers had become a staple across the world of hoops, gaining a reputation as a product that wasn't afraid to push the boundaries to make the best performance shoe possible. The biggest example of this had come with the release of the Kobe 4, one of the first signature basketball sneakers to feature a lower cut around the ankle. Bryant, who had grown up a soccer fan in Italy, had admired how soccer cleats were light and minimalistic while still providing support against injury, a concept he wanted to bring onto the hardwood. As the 2010 season approached, Kobe hoped to take this concept even further with the Kobe 6. Featuring the signature snake scales, a lightweight design, and iconic colorways, the Kobe 6 would take Bryant's signature shoe line to new heights. But it wasn't until Christmas Day 2010 that his sneaker would change the game forever. One of the most anticipated games of this NBA season featuring Kobe Bryant and the two-time defending champion Los Angeles Lakers going up against a team that have hopes of winning multiple titles. With Kobe and the Lakers set to take on LeBron, Wade, Bosh, and the newly formed super team in South Beach, Bryant and the team at Nike knew there would be millions of eyes tuned in on Christmas. And the new look heat were one of the most talked about topics in sports. While all the attention would be on Miami entering the game, Kobe wanted to make a statement with his kicks, electing to design a colorway that would resemble a certain classic Hollywood character whose goal was to steal Christmas. Decked out in the Grinch's classic Volt Green with red accents to highlight the Kobe logo and a signature black swoosh, the aforementioned Kobe 6 Grinch was immediately seen as one of the most iconic basketball sneakers ever. Everyone sitting courtside was given a pair that day, and it wouldn't be long before the shoes became a hot topic across the league. Although Kobe and the Lakers would fall to Miami, the impact of the sneakers themselves would live on far beyond the final buzzer. Today, we see countless players on Christmas Day wearing their own unique holiday-themed colorways, a trend that Bryant elevated when he stepped on the floor that day in 2010. The legacy of the Grinches themselves can be seen across the world, maybe now more than ever before. This year, Nike has released a special sequel to the originals, dropping a reverse Grinch colorway that pays homage to the bold statement made by the classics. The Grinches have become a shoe that you can find players of all ages wearing to this day. From NBA courts to leagues across the world, they are an iconic piece of footwear that goes deeper than just the looks. They're a physical reminder of the lasting impact that Kobe left on the game he loved. A sneaker that gives a little bit of Mamba mentality to all who lace them up.